Hello everybody, my name is Moss Bear, and well, or you can call me Moss, and welcome back to Potion Permit. Last off, we did leave after exploring a little bit, befriending some people, and learning more about the area. We also did, we also managed to finish Rue's quest to unlock her friendship route, and also Yorn. And I'll, we're here, which is kind of off recording, sadly enough. So the, to the, for today's episode, we have a lot of things now to do, you know. But, but for my goal... Is that I'm just gonna try finishing most of these, like talking to Meyer and stuff, which actually I should be doing right now because the town hall is open right now. So Meyer should be in his office up above. So let's go do that real quick. Yep, there he is. Hello, Mars. Look at that rock. Yes, the rock that literally looks like a moon. Our ancestors believed it was found on this island. This island and village took their name from the rock's unique shape. Magnificent, isn't it? Yep. The Trillium Moon Rock. This island has a rich and unique variety of resources. That's why I display all of our island's treasures here. Unfortunately, due to the accident in the past, we've lost so many of them. If you can read Mars, can, would, you, would you help me to restore them? Sure, obviously. Splendid. I hope there's still a way for us to get them back. Wait, so that's just another quest? I thought that was a... Oh, so there it is. That's the actual talking. Okay. So I have to talk to him at least twice because I have two things I have to talk to him. So talk to Meyer. You said you'd like to discuss something with me? Of course, let's head over to my house and talk there in private. Wait, what? The cable car over the glazed iceberg? Hmm, yes, I certainly could give you my permission by promoting your badge level. But you, in order to do that, I would need proof of your qualifications. Do you have anything you could show me to prove you're progressing as a chemist? Hmm... A letter of recommendation from the medical association? Yes, that would do nicely. With the letter in hand, I'd feel more confident about upgrading your badge. Yes, sir. So come and see me once you've got it, alright? Okay. Oh, well, while we're here, let's talk to her. Yeah, she's still far away. Is Rue, is Rue here too? While, while, I, while I'm at it? No, she's not here, sadly. Alright then, let's go. So now we have to talk to... Him again, because... He sent us over here. Dang it. Yes, you want to discuss something? Why don't we discuss it in my office? Oh my god. Okay, now, so this time we don't have to go back to his house. You want to know what happened to part of Mido range? Yep. Oh, for some people that, that didn't watch the previous episode, the Mido range has some sort of weird purplish miasma that was restricted. And here we are to we well, here we are to ask Meyer of what happened to that area because even Forrest, the forest ranger that was in charge of uh, overlooking the area, does not know what it is and it has been there even before even when he was already in, uh, stated as a forest ranger there. Not many of the town- or not many of the townsfolk know the story. The incident occurred many decades ago. There was an accident caused by a chemist from the capital- Oh! See, I knew it! It was- it was caused by people from the past- the chemists from the capital from the past! Back then, the citizens of Moonbury made a deal with some chemists from the capital. I don't really know what it was exactly, but there were some experiments conducted. Sadly, the experiments seemed to not have gone well, they left the area damaged. One of our variety of plants went extinct in the aftermath. Damn. Nobody really knows how to clean up the mess. We found fragments of a report by one of Moonbear's previous chemists. I filed it away in my office. It's in my cupboard, right there. Oh, look at the shiny. <laughs> if you be, if you want to read the, the archives, be my guest. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I think we should figure it out. Because pretty, pretty sure any RPG kind of game will be, will be literally see, fixing every, every, every sort of problem that pops up. <clears throat> Gasp. But really, what, what kind of revelation did we find? Hmm, thinking. Medial range experiment day 89. As instructed by the capital, I, Dr. Samuel, head of the capital's research team on Moonberry, must leave this island because Moonberry citizens no longer wants us here. We have managed to find a potential treatment, but we are unable to apply it as we have been chased off the island. However, I have left some notes in this journal about ingredients for a potential cleansing elixir to reverse the mess the experiment made. I hope anyone reading this journal will finish what we started and restore the vegetation. Get Croft Iris Viral. Iris Vial. Ah, okay. So, the chemist people were not... Well, technically they were kind of bad. They screwed up in this, like, small community. But they did try to make, make, make it right. So, let's see. Oh damn, that is a very big one. Okay, so this is definitely this one. 
and then possibly this. Do I have a four liner? Uh, I don't think so. So it's definitely this. Okay, so yes, so definitely I will need to upgrade my cauldron not only for to make that but also to um, to just fix some things. So let's head over to let's take let's let's head over to the ranch berry and check what what materials we need and we have to grind that for, we'll have to grind for it. Oh, she angry. Xiao, what is this? I've told you so many times not to make this kind of requests. I'm sorry, but I'm just doing my job. Please don't be mad at me. You know what it can you know it can't be helped? You're a legendary blacksmith. Please across the people across the continent would love to get their hands on one of your creations. But not everyone is worthy of my craftsmanship. All of these meaningless requests. A pre premium dagger for a noble lad? Ha! As if he'd know how to wield a dagger. Hold on, I'll take this one. Eh? Why that one? I've got a, my own reasons, boy. You got a problem? Oh damn, Opal Heart really crazy. Really, really uh, putting the pressure on Xiao. Oh no, I'm just curious. You can send rejection letters to the rest of them. And remember, I do not want to see these requests again! <laughs> I wonder what kind of weird requests they, they, they make of her. For her. No, that ma'am, I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. And he and there he leaves. You need anything, Mars? We're gonna ask her what happened. Just looking around, suit yourself. <laughs> okay. So, Runehard. Now, where did I put my tools? Have you seen them? And I should also finish Runehard's quest. I wonder, is there anything for? To upgrade the cauldron, I will need 250 wood and 200 stones. Oof, that is gonna be another long grinding session right for me. Oof, okay. Uh, speaking of, I haven't actually grinded in this in this in this in this new day, so let us go do that real quick. Oh, okay. Well, as usual, another new patient on the next day. We really can't get a break, can we, from patience and stuff? But, but more important, most importantly, oh, a new cutscene. What's this? Oh, our dog, Lemon. Lemon, where are you going? Aha, uh -huh, good boy. Oh, Osman is playing with Lemon. I see. Okay. Hello, Mars. I was on a walk and I stumbled upon Lemon here. Did you see what he did just now? Yep. He was following you and barked on you. He's getting smarter, isn't that right, Lemon? Keep it up, Mars. The closer you grow to your loyal companion, the smarter he'll get. Maybe one day he'll be joining my unit as a guard dog. Haha. <laughs> well, I'll see you both around. We'll play again next time, you hear me? Oh, I guess so. That's basically a reason to maybe... Uh, what you call it? Increase his... Uh, yeah, increase his relationship with us too. So, okay. Let's check our patient. Who it is? Oh, it's Laura. Hello. My right ankle feels weak. My left ankle feels weak. Oh, you broke you broke both your ankles. Jeez. Okay. Let's see. Please just be a quick diagnosis. Of course it'd be. A, of course it'd be a game. Well, that's done. That's one of them. All right. So what do you need? Sun drops. All right. I think I can make that. How about the other leg? I mean the other ankle. All right, another one. That's the other ankle. I really sometimes I really hope that they would explain to me like how did they get their body hurt, you know? So one is bomb and one is is sun drops. Okay, let's make something there real quick. Oh, what a cutscene. Okay. Oh, it's Meyer. Why, hello, Mars. I heard you've made some progress with our community lately, haven't you? Well, that's such a good news for everyone. Would you mind coming with me for a minute? No, I was about to make potions. I have a patient. Meyer, why? Oh, there's Marta out there. There's Zeke too. Oh, wait. Oh, they're actually helping me clean up my area? That's really good. That's really kind of them. After you've been getting along so well, we decided to clear the ground around here. Doesn't it look better now? There are other places that I'd like to fix around the town, you know? 
I want to make this town a better place for everyone. So don't be surprised if you see we've been smarter than Iris move Moonberry up. But most importantly, keep up the good work of getting along with the community. Oh, that's really kind. I shall see you around. Messy garden cleaned. <laughs> Community growth. As you grow closer to Moonberry villagers, the town's condition will start to improve too. Some facilities around the town will get fixed along the way, which might benefit you as well as everyone else living in town. Ah, alright. Okay, so as, as we've been rudely, intruded, ru rudely intrude, interrupted, let's quickly make the vials. Ta da! And that's sun drop. Nice. Alright, we go back to Laura and fix her up. Okay, okay, that's one, and that's the other one. Easy, another treatment done. And of course, everyone's very satisfied, yay. Oh, Mar, thank you for taking care of me, I think I'm okay now. Another moon cloth and more gold. And I believe... I should have enough materials as well to upgrade the cauldron, but I have to wait till around, I think it was 10 or was it 8? Something around there. So let's go check really quick. Is that another cutscene or is this the, the, the thing I'm supposed to go to? Greetings Moss, what perfect timing! What, did, did he just shout? And we're shocked too. I have an urgent request. Opalheart, our blacksmith has requested some materials. It's not like her request for something other than ore. I would recommend you take on this request as the rewards will make it worth your time. How about it? Of course I will take it. Silver nugget and lavender. Dang it! Almost almost there. Oh well, let's talk to Xiao as well while we're at it. Oh, a little bit more. I don't Oh, there's Martha. Hello. Hi Mars. I see you're getting used to our culture of friendship. It's great to see you getting closer to our community. I really hope you keep it up. I'm sure everyone in this town will open their hearts to you eventually. Anyway, I made this earlier today. I wanted you to try my new recipe. Oh no. I hope you'll sweeten your day. Quest completed. Milkshake and recipe unlocked. Okay. We haven't talked to her either, so let's talk to her. You can see Rune Heart being taught by an Opal Heart, it seems. We're almost there! Keep swinging! We've already been going back and forth for ages! Look, your tool is nowhere near polished. When I was your age, I taught myself everything I needed to know. And she's angry. Would you stop comparing me with you? You have to follow in my footsteps and accept my guidance if you want to get better. How are you going to get as good as I am when you're so muddle-headed? Ah! Come back here! Well, that's a disaster. Out of my way! Oh, we're angry. <laughs> this, what an attitude. Go to Lazy Ball Tavern. Tavern. Okay, so it's wait. I was here for I was here for the upgrade anyway. So I'll draw an upgrade. Let's okay. Let's do this. Back at our home. Let's get this upgraded for you. It doesn't look any different to me. I've increased the capacity so you can use more materials now. Thank you very much! Order upgrade 1 completed. I wanna upgrade again? I need a blacksmith upgrade. Alright, so next thing, thing, next thing, snack. Next things I have to do is to upgrade this to 1000 gold, 110, 90, and 100. So 235 wood and 190 rocks. Ooh, there's a lot of things I have to farm. Ooh. Oh well. For the betterment of my gameplay.
No? Right, there's, I remember now. There's a cutscene with Helene as well in the police department. You're on duty today. Make sure all the doors are locked, okay? After what is Derek? What is Helene doing? He's like, he's like, keeps dropping. And she appears. Hi, sweetie. Ah, oh, hi, Helene. Helen, 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 I don't know how to. Oh, uh, are you free tonight? I uh, uh, have things to do this evening. Oh, Dean clearly likes Helen. What are you up to? I have to check all the buildings in the plaza are locked, especially the town hall. Eh? Well, because that's where the mayor's work, obviously, and there's the moonstone. The moonstone? Tell me more. I don't know the details, but it's a trans treasure. Why? Oh, it's nothing. Tee hee. So, are you free later? I have to clean the Marquez machines tonight. Thanks anyway. Oh, he def she definitely saw us uh, taking a peek. Hmm. Huh, suddenly Helen seems suspicious. Suddenly. <laughs> Interesting. And Dean sad. Every time I think I'm getting somewhere with her, she starts avoiding me. Patch. Alright. But that's about it for the aid. So the question now is, where- Oh wait, I haven't talked to her today. Hello? Okay, okay, let's find- Let's find Opal Heart, I guess. Do we have to go to the blacksmith? I guess because that's where she is, usually. So let's go there real quick. I hope you enjoyed the most of I do. I'm pretty sure we get for one. Ironically, okay, you know, I, I, I'm gonna give him this because ironically, like, I have- I, I'm close with everyone else but the mayor. Oh wait, that's her! There she is! There she is! Opal Heart, come back! Quest. You're the one talking my request? Wait here, I'll get it done right away. Ding. Hui! Urnhart, please refer this to Shell for me. Wait, I see a bunch of flowers there on the, other, on the anvil on the right. Interesting. Da, da, da. That request was from a young girl. Eh? She wanted to make her dad a helmet so he'd be safe working as a ranger. That's why I became a blacksmith. Ah. My craft should be helpful and meaningful too. It's not worth my time to make wares people just want to show off. A bit sentimental, you might say. Well, I always follow my instinct. Ah, that's okay. You forgot something. Nope. Oh. Some flowers. The leftover flowers? That's the little girl's favorite flowers. I use some of them to decorate the helmet so the father will have something to remember his daughter by. Oh, the lavender! I see. An unusual request completed. And we're still in here, so let's get out of here because if we closed. Friendship up with Opal Heart. Hmm. Alright. Next thing to do. But I think. I believe that's all I have for today's episode. So again, thank you again guys for watching this episode. I really appreciate all your support for me. If you do like this video, please leave a like and don't forget to comment. And if you like all my content, please don't forget to subscribe as well to my channel. And then, don't forget to follow me on Twitter as well on this hashtag right here. So, thank you again for watching and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.